Hey everyone, welcome back to Just Food Reviews. So choose your own adventure Friday. I never know what's gonna happen. Uh, it was close between Subway and uh, Taco Bell, but basically Subway led start to finish. So doing Subway today. So another one of their Subway series, this is the Mozzarella Bella. So this is what it is. Uh, meet Mozzarella Bella, a twist on, uh, twist on classics you find back in Tuscany. Yeah, right. Uh, this deliciously light and tasty sandwich starts with the perfect combination of fresh veggies, adds mozzarella and Parmesan, uh, then covers it all in our house sandwich sauce and tasty helping of pesto chi bella okay so i memorized what it was before i went in there because i'm just going to order the sandwich i'm going to make sure that they make it right so i go in there and it was that horrible employee that made me the brisket that terrible sandwich and uh so i'm like oh no but there's a guy in front of me and he doesn't want to order a sandwich he wants to hand in a resume so she goes to the side with him this other guy comes out and that's the one who made the sandwich so i order it i watch it he made it right he, he didn't miss anything and he made it look it looks not half bad Okay, so price was actually cheaper, I guess because it has no meat in it. Uh, $7.79 came to $8.20 with tax. So under $10. Uh, so I memorized everything that was on here. It's a spinach, tomato, onion, pesto, Parmesan, uh, fresh mozzarella cheese, and their uh, house sauce. I wonder if their house sauce is like their old sub sauce from back in the day, because I really enjoyed that. So this might have some potential here. And uh, it's supposed to come toasted, so I did that as well. He gave me one napkin, but they were self-serve nap napkins, so I grabbed a couple more. Okay, uh, fresh uh, mozzarella on top, spinach, onions, sauce, tomatoes, and then the pesto on the bottom, and he did put a nice amount of Parmesan in there. We'll see what happens here. Okay, so that uh, house sauce is very similar to their old sub sauce. It might even be the same. That's a bonus, because I do enjoy that. Other than that, I'm not, uh, even the red onions, I'm not getting much flavor from that, because red onions are strong. The pesto almost has no flavor. It's, it's a bland sandwich. It's not terrible, but it's not a lot of flavor other than that sauce. Uh, I, want, I want to give Subway a phone call eventually, but it's just not going to be today. It's too bland. Ah, uh, 5.5. Oh, good. Now I get uh, greasy sauce everywhere too. Maybe I will. I'll, I'll go and I'll see if that guy's working again because he did, he did make it nice and I'll try the meatball one just for one more sometime. <sighs> that actually smashed not bad. It's not a bad smash. Okay, so the mozzarella bella from Subway, it's just a little bit too bland. I do like that they brought the sub sauce back and uh, yeah, what was it, 5.5 out of 10, see you next time.